Yo, what's going on guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Now in today's video guys, we are actually on a Solera, a brand new custom server. In today's video, I'll be doing a server tour, kind of giving you all the ideas of what content they offer. And of course, if you guys find it interesting at any point, make sure and click those links down below. And if it is your first time, make sure and simply type refer and erect you guys. You'll receive all that are right there, a 10% drop rate boost, goodie bags, diamond coins, and Solera mystery boxes by referring me, which is definitely OP, so please do that. Anyway, since it is my first video, I'm going to be doing a fat giveaway today as well. So a $50 scroll to one winner, a $20 scroll to a second, and a $10 scroll to a third. 80 bucks going to three lucky winners, and of course, if you want to enter, make sure and like the video, comment down below your Solar IGN, and of course, subscribe to the channel. First gets 50, second 20, third a $10 scroll. Also, the first comment gets a $10 scroll, so make sure and be notified. But hey guys, like I said, we're going to be doing a server tour today here on this beautiful new custom saver. If you uh, want to come and check it out, if you find the server interesting, if you find it, you know, kind of enjoyable as far as the content you're seeing, make sure and come and join. But Ayo, hey, let's hop into it. Alright, so starting off with a quick little home area tour. As you can see, I'm not going to go through this, guys. It's seriously a pretty chill layout. So yeah, east of Palm, you'll be able to see all of your shops. The ball shop here also offers a collector necklace and loads of other juicy pets. Of course, voting is going to help this over out a ton, and there's a lot you guys can purchase, so save up your vote points. A juicy donator store as well. One donation store is going to have like gear, etc. One's going to have all these scrolls, all these pets you can purchase. There's even a battle royale master. I'm out of order. The battle royale is being updated. That'll be cool once it's here. But hey, of course, when you're going for your upgrades, guys, come over here. There is a fuser machine and an upgrade machine. So pretty much every upgrade you make here on Solera will be through the upgrade machine. You can actually upgrade all these gear setups, guys, scrolls, etc. Super clean. And of course, the fuser machine, other things you guys can fuse. Basically an upgrade machine, but you're fusing items to make a, a better item for, say, like the rainbow aura. You can create if you have all these auras right here. God row as well, which looks super cool, guys. There's a lot of good stuff in here, dude. Tribrid, damage booster, infusion, obsidian sword, lots of stuff. And of course, with it being a brand new server, more should be added down the line, so stay tuned for that. There's even a vote boss minion right here, and if you spend 20 voting points, you can fight an instanced vote boss. It's definitely a lot easier to buy and sell items with a uh, player owned shop as well, so check that up. There's also a load of globals you'll be seeing here spawn, which will give you a lot of good rewards. So when you see them spawn, go to them. They'll all be in the chat. It'll say like lava has spawned. There'll be world bosses, vote balls, etc. Great places to get some juicy rewards. Now, as far as content goes, there's so many bosses, including a Rekchu's boss. You heard it right, baby. A Rekchu boss. This truly makes me so hyped, dude. I only serve Rekchu's daddy. That's what I like to see. She's got me by the balls as well. These texts are funny. All right, all right. Yo, seeing a Rekchu boss, dude, this makes me truly hype. It even drops the Rekchu set at a 1 in 4,500 chance per piece. If you're a Rekchu fan and not camping this boss, I am so sad. I want to see everybody wearing the Rekchu set here on Solera. That would just be mwah. Beautiful, boys. Love to see it. Spawn events as well, which will be acted by the owners. Dude, there's so many bosses, though. It's quite insane. All the monsters here as well. And I actually like the interface. It shows you, like, each drop table from them uh, certain NPCs. And, of course, it shows you, like, their example of their HP, max hits, difficulty. There's a Defender's minigame, Weapons, Magic, Range, and Beginner AoE Zone. So this Beginner AoE Zone seems like a great place for new players to come to get your first AoE here on Solera. Plenty of multi-bosses as well, like LT Lines. we got Slifer the Sky Dragon, Fallen Lord, Knight of the Torment. Wait, Talos has spawned as well. Let's go. We're at level 3, so it's hard to actually not die, but we got to kill. Legolas Plate Body. Some diamond coins as well, and your one hit to me to 150 stats, bro. So, leveling up is obviously very quick. We are wearing some OP gear, but I would assume that it's probably fast for anybody. In chat, you'll also notice we're completing achievements. They do have fully working achievements and collection logs. Now, on top of that, there's actually four plus raids in game right now, and none of them have a requirement. So, it's simple create the party, hop into it, boys, and grind. Actually, so chill. And of course, more raids should come, but four being on the release right now, that is pretty juicy. Raids are always a big thing for customs, so you love to see it. Just like that, another globalized spawn, being Darth Vader. Achievements are always nice, they give you an extra grind, and of course more rewards, so eh, why not? They're also categorized, you got easy, you of course got medium right here guys, and then of course hard, and expert. Just about every boss or monster in a game does have a collection log, so once you guys complete those, there should be rewards coming for them soon. Right now I don't think there is one, it's just a collection log. 
but soon there should be a reward for completion. Now once you guys hop in, I would definitely recommend you hop in a Slayer. That's always a good thing to do starting out. The Slayer shop holds a full Slayer set. We got cash instant zones, legendary boxes, and of course a collector necklace. Ringo Wealth, pretty lovely. You're probably seeing this as well, Abominable Snowman. So yeah, you need to come to Colon Colon Train, knock these out when you log in, and you actually get a lot of rewards. Pretty sure there's multiple zones as well, so you start here, then go to the next zone, the next zone, the next zone, until so you are done with that, and you should get a lot of stuff. A lot of my viewers are going to be happy to see they do have fully working gambling as well, which is always fun. Now as far as gear goes, you'll be seeing stuff like Goku, Emperor, Set Guys, the Vegeta, Stormtrooper, Bikini Set, things like that here on Solera, I think is quite nice. Now in the next video, I definitely plan on going more into uh, the PVM side of the game, showing you guys what that's all about, and of course just, uh, yeah, enjoying the server all around, that's what it's for. But today, I just wanted to let you all know that Solera is out, and if you guys want to check it out, the links are down below. There's a lot of content here, guys, and it is a pretty juicy custom. Obviously brand new, so the players, we need those. Click those links down below and be one of the beautiful players that joined today. And of course, once you join, make sure and use my referral code, REFERRECTYOU, for an OP starter pack. But hey guys, hope to see you in-game one more time. I love you all, and I'll see you all in the next one. Have a great rest of your day, and peace.